From United Nations Television, this is UN in Action. In southern Africa, a deadly strain of drug-resistant tuberculosis called MDR-TB is hitting a growing number of people. Particularly affected are people living in remote areas. In the mountainous kingdom of Swaziland, where TB is the leading cause of death, efforts are underway to bring the much-needed care to people like Kulseel. She contracted tuberculosis two years ago. I was feeling feverish. I was coughing a lot. For people here, making regular visits to the nearest clinic, often miles away, is a huge challenge. Whether they want to reach there or not, they can't because there's no transport. Sanil M. Conta, a nurse and head of the tuberculosis section of the local clinic, is now bringing the crucial medication to Kulseel. She's developed MDRTB because she couldn't complete her earlier treatment. This virulent strain occurs when patients fail to adhere to the prescribed medicine, and it's more difficult to treat. I think it's very important for us to come to bring the services to the people, not the people to come to us. If we can do that, I think we can eliminate it completely. To improve care for the rural population, the Bafalali Swaziland Red Cross has recently strengthened its home-based care, sending nurses to people's homes, making sure that patients get their medicine and receive their treatment. Home visits are vital, believes Nathi Gomede, the Secretary General of the Bafalali Swaziland Red Cross Society. For us, going closer to the people is the key. We also would like to uh, provide the service at community level, make sure that our nurses are given capacity to provide testing and treatment uh, at the community level. Swaziland, which is one of the highest tuberculosis rates in the world, is facing a momentous battle against this highly contagious disease. Lukika Ditu is the executive secretary of the World Health Organization's Stop TB Partnership. We need to do everything we can to dramatically reduce tuberculosis globally. We can do it only in partnership, and only if we can work together, we can find new ways to prevent, diagnose, and treat tuberculosis. Working closely with local communities is critical in saving lives. Cool Seal is getting better. It makes me happy to know that I'm feeling stronger. Despite hardship, the people of Swaziland are resilient. There are many who are determined to work together to beat the scourge of tuberculosis so that the children of this country can move into the future with hope.